Hello guys and today I'm going to show you my list for the top 5 best gaming laptops that you can buy under $1000. So without any further ado, let's get started. So number 5 on the list is the Asus Tough F15. The Asus Tough F15 is one of the best budget gaming laptops that you can buy. At $650, this laptop offers most of what you would need including a dedicated GPU and a high refresh rate display. The build quality and design is quite solid. The design fully embraces its gaming roots but does it in such a way that it actually looks pretty decent without an overload of different colors. Also for a gaming laptop, it is quite thin and light and is solid in its construction. The display here may not be the best looking on this list but is definitely more than good enough for gaming. It is a 15.6 inch Full HD panel at 144Hz that feels really smooth to not just game on but also regular browsing just feels much more responsive on 144Hz. The specs on this include an Intel Core i5-10300H processor, 8GB of RAM, a 512GB PCIe SSD and the Nvidia GeForce GTX 1650. Gaming performance on this is quite good and this is basically the perfect starting esports laptop that you can buy right now. I would also recommend upgrading the RAM to 16GB just so you can get the most out of your laptop and after that it is a solid option to consider. Number 4 on the list is the HP Vectors 15. The HP Vectors 15 is a 12th gen gaming laptop that is also a great editing laptop. The laptop comes in at $775 and you get a color accurate display and a thin build for a gaming laptop. The build quality is solid with a mix of metal and plastic. The look of the laptop is clean with no extra colors and only Vectors branding that is a bit stand out. It does have a flat build all around and a thin body that is easy enough to carry around. The display on this is a 15.6 inch Full HD 144Hz IPS panel that offers good viewing angles, accurate colors and a smooth gaming experience. The display gives good immersion when gaming and is particularly nice when editing photos and videos. The specs on this go hand in hand with the display to allow for video editing and gaming. The specs on this include an Intel Core i5-12450H CPU, 16GB of RAM, a 1TB SSD and the Nvidia GeForce GTX 1650. Performance is actually really solid and the 12th gen CPU allows you to edit at higher resolutions without lag and slowdowns. Thermals on the laptop are also pretty decent and you can really get the laptop to get warm and thermal throttle. So number 3 on the list is the Lenovo IdeaPad Gaming 3. The Lenovo IdeaPad Gaming 3 is one of the best sellers from Lenovo recently in the gaming lineup and is known to be a great laptop in the mid-range segment. This is the first laptop with an RTX GPU on this list and you can definitely feel the performance difference in some games. The build on this is quite good. It isn't anything too extreme or premium but it's still solidly built with no sign of flex or creaking. It has a plastic body with a striped finish on it that actually looks decent in person without being too flashy. The display on this is a 15.6 inch Full HD IPS panel at 120Hz. The 120Hz is definitely the best part about the display as in terms of colors and contrast, it falls short when compared to the HP Vectors but it does provide gamers with a smooth gaming experience in esports titles and even for the regular user, browsing windows and the web just feels snappy. The specs on this include an AMD Ryzen 5 5600H CPU, 8GB of RAM, a 512GB SSD and the Nvidia GeForce RTX 3050 Ti graphics. This laptop is a definite step up over the previous laptop in terms of gaming performance and the performance on this is such that you can play almost every game out at high settings at 1080p. Number 2 on the list is the Acer Nitro 5. The Acer Nitro 5 has been consistently one of the best gaming laptops that you can buy. At just under $1000 with this model, you get a i7 CPU and an RTX GPU like the IdeaPad Gaming 3. The build quality on this is decent. The laptop is definitely a gaming laptop through and through from its look to its build and size. It is a heavy laptop with a large span due to the larger display. As a gaming laptop, it is fine but if you want to carry it around everywhere, it can pose some problems. The display on the Acer Nitro 5 is a 17-inch Full HD panel at 144Hz. Again, the refresh rate on these displays allow for smooth gaming but this one just feels a bit better due to the larger size of the display. In terms of colors, contrast and viewing angles though, it isn't anything too special and is about what you'd expect here which is decent. The specs on this include an Intel Core i7-11800H CPU, 16GB of RAM, 
a 1TB SSD and the Nvidia GeForce RTX 3050. Gaming performance wise, this absolutely delivers and the laptop should be enough if you want to stream lightly, game at high FPS and render graphics quickly. So number 1 on the list is the Dell G15. The Dell G15 is a really powerful gaming laptop with insane specs for under $1000. The build quality and design on this is very unique even for a gaming laptop. It ditches the traditional black color and comes in white with a speckle type pattern with stripes and red accents. It looks really nice in person and has a sturdy construction and a nice soft feel. It is also quite big like the Acer Nitro 5 but the look of it is much more modern and stylish. The display on this is a 120Hz Full HD IPS panel with good colors and sharpness. The 120Hz is a slight step down that you won't even notice at times from the other laptops I've mentioned before and it too gives a smooth experience with color accuracy that should be good for beginner to intermediate editors and designers. The specs on this include an AMD Ryzen 7 5800H CPU, 32GB of RAM, a 1TB PCIe SSD and the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3050 Ti. 32GB of RAM is insane to have on a laptop at this price and it should allow for faster and smoother rendering, better multitasking and some performance benefits in gaming as well. Overall, I'd say that this is a solid option to consider for this price and might be one of the best laptops under $1000. So that's it for the video guys, thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe to the channel and I hope you've enjoyed this video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.